A British graffiti artist has been taking his artwork and his mission of peace to countries all around the world. The man known as Aerosol Ali recently visited New York where he paid special tribute to the young victims of a terrible fire in the Bronx. British TV correspondent Salim Rizvi was there to cover it for us. Muslim mural artist Muhammad Ali vowed residents of East Mount Eden Road in the Bronx when he painted a mural on a wall. Ali was painting a mural in memory of the Bronx fire victims of Magasa and Somari families. Aisha Magasa, who lost several children in the tragedy, also participated in the painting. She is still recovering from injuries suffered in the fire. The English text of the painting has also been specially chosen for the occasion. Inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi rajiyaun, which is a Quranic verse Muslims recite upon hearing of someone's death. Murals which kind of reflect spiritual messages that connect different faith communities, you know, messages that and, and principles that Muslims and Christians and people of all different faiths can kind of share, you know, principles like peace and knowledge, things like this. Um, but specifically, the, the, this mural, the wall I'm working on behind me in the Bronx, uh, as a more of a, uh, a focus upon a, uh, the kids that, that the nine children from the Mugasa family that, that uh, and, the, and the Samara family that, that, that died in the, in the New York fire, in the Bronx fire. So this wall is still a very spiritual message, similar to what I, a lot of my other work is, but this one is a focus, uh, like a memorial piece for the kids that died. Muhammad Ali's is a unique fusion of aerosol art with Islamic calligraphy that connect people of all backgrounds and cultures and the art has returned to the home of graffiti, the Bronx. But the graffiti has taken an urban art form from street walls to galleries. Ali also interacted with kids in the Bronx who were quite happy to have a graffiti with a purpose. The artist has teamed up with Arts Council England in this educational tour named Arts and Islam. To be here in the Bronx. This is a project that we funded and sponsored. It's a new kind of project for the Arts Council England, which is a big national institution. And for Arts Council money to come here and put Muhammad Ali, aerosol Arabic, the graffiti, uh, uh, Islamic graffiti artist here in the Bronx, doing this fantastic mural uh, for the, um, the memorial to the children from Mali who were killed in a tragic fire, is for us so exciting. Some Muslim American organizations like Islamic Circle of North America are also helping in this ambitious effort in New York City. They appreciate someone coming and doing this artistic piece for them, but they're also looking at it as a form of dawah for the rest of the community. And I think that's the most important aspect of this. And also the diversity that's being represented here today, because we have Muslims from all over the world coming. I mean, it's amazing that this, this Muslim brother from you know, Bangladesh roots, living in London, coming all the way to America to do a mural for an East African family living in New York. And myself, being an American Muslim, learned about um, Brother Muhammad Ali's art and his work and his trip to the U.S. from an Islamic artist, Lisser, that I belong to. So when I saw that he was coming to the U.S., I, I had to see about getting him to come to New York. Muhammad Ali's U.S. tour include mural paintings and lectures on Islamic art in various cities including Boston and Chicago. Ali has also showcased his work across the UK, Dubai and Denmark. This is Salim Rizvi reporting for Ridges TV in New York City.